817 TQQQ ETF. It moves the most. This is a monthly chart. And it is on the fifth month breakout as we speak. Problem is, it's overbought on a monthly level. I'd be, be very cautious on this one because it's been driving higher. Let's take a look at it on a weekly level. Oh, yeah. See, we're 95.98. It's, you know, it's got a little bit more room that it can pop up there. Let's go ahead and take a look at it. That's a weekly chart. Let's take a look at it on a daily. And here we have on a daily at about 97.5. So, CCI is right about there. I would say on a daily, you know, we can push higher. It had a big breakout today, and it's, it's certainly been breaking out. And I can say that by looking at it here, yeah, on that monthly level, it is overbought. Now, we are at an overbought level here, and if we get any more upside, it's going to create that much more of an overbought level. But once again, it had a $4.83 move in their day range on the TQQQ, which we like a lot better than the QQQ because it moves more uh, in dollar terms uh, with the uh, options and whatnot. So this is this. We're going to be on it. Uh, we are at the first stage of it again being overbought and last uh, week when we did hit the highs uh, of 131 and then the lows were 117 that went straight down so today's only Monday and that reading there can top up a little bit higher but if it does that then that means that the bull cycle is at the high end of the cycle and you can go higher a little bit but once again we took the move on the call side but we exited because we are in that overbought zone and it's a great trade you know it's one that you hold overnight and you get great moves out of it um, we've had other corrections and I'm talking about corrections like this pullbacks is what I'm talking about and we've getting up here to that period on the TQQQ. We do have a little bit more room that it can run up, but as it runs up, then it's going to run into what we call a stage two overbought level. And then we'll see exactly what will happen at that point. I would be very cautious from here on out on the TQQQ ET.